Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning in and thanks for subscribing. Before we get started, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and notification bell twice so you'll be notified when I upload new videos and I upload new videos multiple times a week. Today on Creative Glam, I'm participating in a collaboration and this collaboration is called Game Day Appetizers. This collaboration is being hosted by This and That with Denise Jordan and Mickey of Live, Laugh, Love, Pray. In case you haven't seen their channels, I will link both of their channels down below in the description box. Make sure you go by and check them out. After finish watching my video, check out the playlist of the other participants in this collaboration. I'm sure it's going to be delicious. I can't wait to see the videos myself. Now the requirements of this video is that we create game day appetizers they don't have to be healthy they can have as many or as little calories as you like so today on creative glam i'm going to share with you how i make my chicken and waffle sliders let's get started one of the things i love so much about this recipe is that it's super simple i'm just going to use the pre-prepared popcorn chicken by purdue i'm going to bake these off in the oven at 425 for 15 minutes. You can use a whole bag or as many as you need. And then I'll take the waffles. I just use the Eggo waffles, the minis. You can use the round ones as I'm using here. Or I prefer the cinnamon toast Eggo mini waffles. Those have that cinnamon taste to it, but I'm gonna add a little bit to this. So I'm gonna bake these off in the oven right along with my popcorn chicken. And you're gonna need two per piece of chicken. You can do one or two. I prefer doing two, and that's enough for eight sliders. The oven is ready. Okay, guys, they're all done. Now that they've come out of the oven, while they're still hot, I'm gonna sprinkle them with a little bit of Lowry's, and then we can assemble them. As I said before, it's almost like make sandwiches. Then I take a piece of chicken, and I take a waffle. And a pig. Just like that. That's just super easy. And I alternate between the red and the blue for the NFC and the AFC. Take, break the waffles in half. And you can make as many of these as you need because you know how many are coming over. I would probably do about three of these per person. You make them according to the number of guests you're gonna have, plus whatever else you're serving with it, whether you're doing uh, burger sliders or whether you're doing um, chili, ribs, whatever it is. You put the waffles in the pan, add a little butter, throw them in the oven after the chicken is about halfway done. I take the chicken, I sprinkle it with a little Lowry's before, and then I sprinkle it with a little Lowry's when I'm done.
I topped them off with a little bit of syrup, the syrup of your choice. And I added a little green garnish. I added a ramekin of syrup in the center for dipping. I estimate about two per person, two to three. I estimate about two to three per person, depending upon the number of guests and depending upon what else is on your menu. And that's it guys, we're all done. Yum. Thanks for tuning in and thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my best game day appetizers. I wanna thank Denise of This and That with Denise Jordan and Mickey of Live, Laugh, Love and Pray for inviting me to participate in their best game day appetizer collaboration. It was lots of fun. If you enjoyed it as well, hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit the notification bell twice. This way you'll be notified when I upload new videos and I upload new videos multiple times a week. And remember to like and share because it helps my channel to grow. I have also linked other videos down below in the description box. Make sure you check those out too. And now that you've finished watching my video, there's a link to the playlist down below. Check out the other participants in this collaboration. Again, I'm sure it's going to be delicious. And on that note, enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you right back here on Creative Glam. Bye! <laughs>